Hey guys, this is David, and I want to let you know that over the next four weeks, I'll be releasing 10 to 15 hand-picked SHOT Show videos to YouTube for everyone to enjoy. So if that's all you want from SHOT Show this year, awesome. That's all you'll get on the Ultimate Survival Tips YouTube channel. But if you can't get enough of SHOT Show and want to check out all 50 videos that I shot this year, I'm making them all available on the Ultimate Survival Tips show on Carbon TV. So to get even more SHOT Show videos right now, Click the link on your screen or in the video description to subscribe for free. Plus, you'll have access to monthly giveaways and nearly 100 other top outdoor, hunting, shooting, and survival shows. Okay, well, I think you're really going to like what I've got queued up in this video, so let's get started. So go ahead, Ken. Tell me about this knife. So this is a new uh, Mora Kniev Garberg. Okay. Uh, it's the first full tang Mora knife. It uses a 14C28N Sandvik stainless steel. And that means something, because yes, I, I know that yeah. Sandvik steel is very, very high end, and it's expensive steel. Yeah. So can you tell me a little bit about the properties of the steel? Because the guys are going to want to know that. Yeah, the, the properties of this, this uh, the steel are, it's very high on the Rockwell hard, hardness scale. So you got about a 58 on the Rockwell hard, hardness scale. Uh, also, it allows it to, uh, you can baton the knife, uh, and it's going to still retain its edge. So it's really high quality, uh, low impurities on as far as steel go. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and it's not too hard. So no, no, you it's, get a brittleness. To you, it. You're not, and it's it it finds that that blend of hardness and durability where it's not going to uh, crack or break. And I know it's a great steel for edge retention too. Yeah, it is excellent. Uh, we've we've been testing these uh, for about three months now out in the field. Uh, we actually have Dave Canterbury uh, actually field testing this, and uh, he loves it so far. And it's it's. He says he hasn't sharpened his once since uh, he's been using it. And he's been here. And I know Dave does not stand behind or he just doesn't even do this kind of no, stuff. No, no. So he must really believe in this place. We're, we're very fortunate to have Dave back in this knife, and he's a big supporter of the, the Garberg. Cool. So tell, tell us a little bit more about this knife. Uh, well, the, the Garberg uses a uh, Sandvik, or Sandvik stainless steel. Um, and then it also has a Scandi grind here, which if you use a Mora knife in the past, uh, you'll know that, that it's very easy to sharpen. Uh, you just find that edge when you're, when you're sharpening the knife. It also has a polyamide grip. Uh, the polyamide grip, it's, it's very durable uh, polymer, uh, and it's, very, it's known for its durability, and it's basically indestructible when it's on this, this knife. So yep. it's, it's a great knife. Uh, also, and the, the grip feels really good. I was, it, it does. It's they, I they use it. In, it. Yep. They, they use it in the uh, commercial grade uh, knives, so it's yep. very very durable. And it's and it's a little bit thicker, so it really fits your palm swell nice. Yeah. Yep. You'll notice also that the the handle is symmetric, so it's great if you're left or right handed. And you'll notice that the tang uh, they left a little bit of the tang coming out of the handle of the knife. So if you needed a baton with the, the knife on the back or break a window, uh, it allows you to do that. Uh, there's also a little lanyard hole so you can put some paracord or some sort of uh, some sort of line out of the back of the, the knife. around your wrist. Exactly. Security, yep. Um, so that, that, that's some of the main features on the knife. And it is a full tang knife. Let's full, just make that clear. Full and tang knife. And you can actually see the tang of the knife here. Uh, so that's where the hole for the, where the lanyard is. And then these extra holes are where the machine moves the knife around when they're product, uh, in the production process. Uh, the sheath of the knife is actually where it uh, really uh, stands out from other Mora knives. Uh, one thing you'll notice is it does have a, a molly sheath uh, attachment. Uh, this will allow you to attach this to a molly sheath. Uh, you can attach it upside down ah, in, in a very a variety nice. of configurations. And it's a nice slim profile, so yes. it would fit nice even on a tactical vest or something exactly. like that if you wanted to. Yep. Uh, you'll also notice that there's a snap here so that it'll keep the, retain the knife in the, in the sheath. Uh, there's also 
allows you to remove this. So if this is uh, the skeleton of the sheath is on your Molly uh, vest or pack, you can actually remove the knife out of the sheath uh, and take it with you if you're, you know, processing an animal or preparing a meal, something like that. Or if you just want to drop it in your pocket, it looks exactly. like you, it, you really wouldn't even feel it much because it's about as low profile as you can get. Exactly. No, no low snag points. Yeah. And you can also take, ah. you'll be able to take this ah. off okay. and there'll be a, a belt attachment. So if you wanted to run around uh, with just the belt attachment, it allows you to do this while you keep this on your Molly vest. Um, so, and this will go in either way, like I said, for uh, left or right handed. Yep. yep. So it's uh, very lightweight, uh, so that it's uh, very, very durable polymer as well. You can have all of your carry options consolidated right here. Yes. Or you can cho just choose what you want out of yeah. the three carry options. It's, it's one of the vers most versatile uh, knives that Moore has ever, ever made. That's very, very nice. That's nice engineering right there. I like it. Cool. Well, great. Yeah. Was there anything else you wanted to share about the knife? No, that's about it. Yeah, the, we're, we're looking at a, a starting price of uh, MSRP of ninety nine ninety five. Okay. Uh, so it's 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 a little bit step up from what Mora uh, has done in the past, but it, this is this is not it's it's unlike any other Mora knife that's ever been made out on the market. Uh, first full tang, high quality steel, polyamide grip, Molly sheath. A uh, variety of attachments. It's one of the most versatile knives out there. Um, also, one more thing that I wanted to show you. It does have the flat uh, grind on the, the back of the, the knife. So it wood. allows you to scrape some fat wood. Uh, just take a small amount. And you can al actually also use it with a, a fire steel. Uh, so a great little survival tool. Very nice. Very nice. That gives me more to think about. Excellent. And hey, here's a new Mora knife that's full tang, and it costs $100. Well, we're, we're, I think you filled in the gaps for us. Excellent. Yeah. I appreciate your time, David. Yeah, thanks, Ken. All right. Okay, have a great show, bud. For your convenience, I've included links to all the gear that we've mentioned in the video description. Just click the Show More tab under this video. And for all 50 of our SHOT Show 2016 videos, click the link on your screen or in the video description your free subscription to the Ultimate Survival Tip Show on Carbon TV. Thanks for watching.